Hello, hello everyone. Happy Saturday. Hope you are all doing good. Welcome to the first of many Let's Plays. And today we are playing... Ah, oh, the music makes me feel so good every time. Pixel Ripped, 1978, the third of the current trilogy. Normally they make a, a bit of a splash about when they say it's like finishing the trilogy, but I feel like with these games they could just keep making them. Uh, I hope you're doing well. Welcome to Let's Plays. I do one of these every weekend, except we're not doing one every weekend anymore. We're doing as many as I can, and this weekend we are doing six. So if you go to my YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash miles, and scroll down to the Let's Play section, you can... No worries, no worries. So I can hear the chat in my ears right now, and some people are saying, dropping a like, stopping by, leaving, because I don't want the game to be spoiled. I can totally respect that. And that's what these Let's Plays are about. I'll give you a sense of what the games are like from the very beginning. We'll play an hour, 90 minutes. I'll take a break, and then I'll come back for another game. Um, but yeah, on the YouTube channel, in the Let's Play section, uh, you can see all the different PSVR 2 games. So, without further ado, just making sure we're looking good. We're looking good, and I'm hoping to stay cool. Um, you're going to play this seated. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do slot 2. Oh, I love the music. So Pixel Ripped is uh, by Arvo uh, and my good friend Anna Ribeiro, who I always bang on about. She is an inspiring game developer uh, who once had a dream about a game. And so she left her life in Brazil um, working. Uh, I think she was a ba she, she was a, she made pies. She was a baker um, and then she came to the UK, studied for a few years or not even that. I think a couple of years game design. Uh, and then built what ended up becoming the Pixel Rip series. And what makes these games great is you are basically playing a game in a game and you are going back in time to feel the retro gaming feels. So right now, here I am, and I'm actually going to be grabbing this and now I can, I'm actually playing this game. There once was a hero named Dot, so Dot is the character we're playing as. Her job was and still is to protect far of a land, her home. She's also the guardian of the pixel stone. The very soul of the game world. A guide is master, her master. Together, they saved far off a land many times. They did it using the powerful player sync. Player sync connects Dot to a skillful player. Through that connection, Dot gets new and important powers. But who attacked Dot's land? Cyblin Lord did. He's an evil goblin who craves power and tried to steal the pixel stone for that. But Dot managed to stop him. Hooray. <laughs> Breaking news. Our first year of peace anniversary party is about to start. Far of a land's villagers are very excited for this event. I don't know about you, chat. I would love it if a chicken told the news. Oh, and if Dot's watching this, I'm Dot. Thank you for defeating Cybin Lord one year ago in 1995. You're the reason this celebration is taking place. Now make sure to use L to move, which I'm using now, and talk to your fellow citizens. They will appreciate it. So here I am. 
Use the uh, left stick to move and press uh, to interact with an object. Um, if I turn the TV off, no. Now turning is very slow, so I'm just going to go in the options. I believe. I don't think. I don't think you can actually. Here we go. Movement. Oh, it's just soft. Yeah. So um, turning in the game is. Um, not very fast. And like some of the classic games like Doom, I believe you travel faster if you go diagonal. So as long as you keep going diagonal, you can travel a lot faster. It is known that the Pixel Stone is the most precious artifact from our world. Its unimaginable power is coveted by all evildoers in far of a land. What's the matter with the snap turning? I, I personally don't like snap turning. I like smooth turning. That's just how I've always rolled. Um, but of course, it's an option for people that want it. Anyway, let's go out and check out the, the town. I love it. I just love the fact. And there's all these characters from the previous games that you played. What's up, dude? Congrats on the piece and all that. Maybe later you could give me some pointers on how to beat villains. See, look, am I right? So look, this is going forward. This is going sideways. But if you go diagonal, I think that's faster. I could be wrong though. Maybe it's just a perspective thing. Hey Doc, can you bring me a carrot from the farm? You know, the one close to us. Yeah. I've got a hoe. I tell you what, the um, the haptic feedback. Yeah, you can adjust your walking speed in the settings. I think this is a, a actually I could maybe make it a bit faster. Um, thank you, hero. From evil goblins to bad cakes, you can't seem to stop saving us. Let's sing our hour-long anniversary song. No. I have to say, the haptics, I don't know how to explain it. It's like when you hit and hit hit stuff with it, you get like the feeling of a little shake, like you feel the vibration going down the uh, the hoe. It's so good. It's amazing how really subtle things can uh, be so just cool. Uh, right, yeah, let me uh, just go to options again and uh, comfort with this. Uh, yeah. Or did that not save it? Oh, it did. Okay. Yeah, a lot of people in the chat are talking about the ball in the cup thing that Nintendo Switch did, which I never played, but supposedly it was um, pretty impressive. Oh, he's just... No. Oh, here we go. Hey, master. Where are we going? I understand today is supposed to be joyful, but I have some bad news. I've received readings of Sidin Lord's presence in the party. I dropped it. Dramatic effect. Let's go back to your house and I'll explain everything. Can't we talk here? Yeah, look, diagonal is faster. See? That was the perfect test. I'll show you on the screen what I discovered. Oh no, security footage has shown that Cybin Lord is currently travelling to various years in the past. Ah, oh, this reminds me of just like Master System stuff. going after the inspiration crystals, mighty artifacts that represent the creation of our game world. If he messes with them, he messes with core aspects that make up our land. 
We need to stop him before something terrible happens. Luckily, I have an idea. This on the screen is what I call a time breach. Since our villain friend is using magic, he doesn't fully control. He's been leaving them behind. They will take you straight to that wicked goblin. I like that when you look behind the characters, they're the same on both sides, like the classic sprites. And don't worry about figuring uh, out time travel. We use our time machine to send you back to the year he was last seen. 1983. Hey, welcome to the chat. And yes, so many games. I declared... Actually, let's go outside. Cyberlaw is interfering with artifacts from our past. And the present is suffering the consequences. Quick, dress yourself. We're sending you to 1983 at once. Look at this. Oh, the, the vibration. Here we are. i got a gun now. To the time machine and onwards. To 1983. <laughs> Almost as good as the mirror in the Wanderer trailer, someone said. Um, oh, it just feels great. Who needs cake when the world is ending? Ice cream works better with chaos. Ice cream. Uh, I like that. Go on without me. I'll be fine. I need to keep an eye on our beloved villagers. So 1983 at once. So I declared that I was going to be playing every PSVR 2 as an individual Let's Play. And that is still the plan. But then the last three weeks I've been designing thumbnails for like 80 something games. So many new PSVR 2 titles have been announced. I'm going to be playing about three new games next week, potentially four, so um, you want to tune in next week as well. Uh, do I intend to beat this game today? Probably not. I'm going to be playing this for... That's how, how are we doing for time now? I haven't even got my watch on. Um, going to be playing this for maybe like an hour and a half to uh, two hours, and then we're going to switch on to the next game, which is... Uh, Transformers Beyond Reality and then after that it survived so three games we're playing today um, all green beings welcome far of a land nah never heard of it Ooh. Dot can you hear me this phone is awful so you've reached 1983 that's good I understand it looks very different from our own land that's Cybin Lord's influence over the crystals now Look for the time breaches. Yes, I said breaches, not... Anyway. Once you enter one, you'll access the moment in the past few years. Oh, you don't see any around. Well then, let's use a player sync. Remember, we use the sync to connect you to the best player available. So much exposition in this game. <laughs> You can join forces to find a breach as the connection opens up new powers for you. The player you'll sink to is very special. She's called Bug. She's very important to Far of a Land. She is our creator, after all. See if there's any sync platforms around you to connect to Bug. And if you ever get lost, remember to check your communications gauntlet. Look at your left wrist for guidance. Okay. So it tells me what we collectibles, I guess. Oh. And there's loads of these that I can collect. That's cool. Hello, chicken. Let's just collect some of this. not here to rob me. Some criminals just stole my goods. All I have left is this portal. I can trade it with you for the price of one chicken. Let's go. 
Diagonal, diagonal, diagonal. <laughs> Hello, chicken. Who are you calling chicken, bath bag? How do I... How do I pick up the chicken? Do I need to... S Maybe I gotta. Maybe I had to finish speaking. Oh yeah, look. There we go. So how we doing, chat? Is everyone staying cool and well hydrated? It is so warm here today. Here we. There we go. Got the chick. I don't know what was going on there. Hey. Yes, that's a fine hen. Everyone knows that chickens are the best security guards. And they're good news reporters too. They are always angry. Now, for the portal I promised. I guess I just stand in it. And then, do this. Too hot for VR, one of you says. So you're going to watch me do it instead. Well, that's good. Yeah, bring the storms. Agreed. There's Bug. Sidelin whipped. Third floor. Alright, let's uh, just do this stuff. I think. Woo! So cool. Hey. So this is why you play it sat down. Oh. Bentley's quest. Oh, the button is, uh... Huh? <laughs> Look at the heroes here. Right. Oh, it is letting me press the button. I'm making my mark in the developers. So that's everything she produces in her present. Crystal castles, pixel rips. No. No. No! I can't take the coach. Cyblin whipped. Now interestingly, it said Cyblin whipped before we turned up. So it all... Oh yeah, because it already happened. Chadster in the yeah, house. You're very hey, weird. Did you see our newest concept art? Wait. Who's that guy? <laughs> that doesn't look like our hero. Oh, we need to sell this game for the holidays. <laughs> Not Halloween. What a scary looking fella. Uh, where's the concept art for Dot and Master? Tell me it's not in the trash. <laughs> Hey, there they are! Kids will love them! So, yeah, I need you to get rid of that ugly guy and fix the game art ASAP. I say this as both your boss and your friend. This guy is creepy. <laughs> okay, thanks. Morning, bag! Ooh, we have a Cyblin Lord fan here. But isn't it a little much since yeah, he should he did be steal like my draft. the villain? 
Anyways, I brought you some donuts. Making games is way harder than oh. we thought when we were kids, you know? We need to Make keep sure our sugar level high. Like it. And since I'm your bestest friend ever, I'll fix your broken controller too. Thank you. Can you hand it to me? Yep. Take it. Got to do it. There you are! Brand yet. new! I have this new prototype for it that I'm working on. I might bring it over later. I hope it helps your game and that other one you gotta test. Oh, yeah. You know, the one on your desk. Anyways, see ya! You remember? Remember doing this as a kid? Oh yeah. Smells like nostalgia. So you do blow into it, that's awesome. Oh. Hello Barbara. Nolan here. I hear you've got a new character we can use. We should get together and chat about it. Okay, let's play this. Bentley's quest. Okay, can't go that way. So who in the chat or watching on replay in the comments, uh, who owned an Atari? My first console was a Sega Master System. And then I had a Sega Mega Drive. Oh, you press down and jump to go below it, that's cool. So guys! Listen to many good records lately? N64 cartridges, yeah. Okay, can't go this way. It's really cool, I, I remember this. Let's just go up here first. I can't go up there. You had an Atari VCS, really, one of these. Yeah, I never played Atari, obviously I played a lot of the classic games. So now we're going into the game. We're now in the game. How cool is this? There's a key there. It's so colourful. And there's the dragon that was holding that platform that we... Uh... Okay, I'm just going to keep going diagonal, because diagonal makes you go faster. I love the art design and the light, oh, it's just so cool. Hello, Bentley. Hi, it's very nice to meet you. I'm Bentley, the bear. Yes, this is my question in, but I'm afraid I can't restart it. I need my bag of gems to do so, and I kind of locked it inside my own house. Yes, but I lost my keys too. I know, not my brightest moment. Please, just help me get my keys, and I'll give you a prize. Bear's honor. Let's do it. Let's go, Bentley. I don't trust chickens. They make good security guards, remember? Whoa! So, um... So I've played this level already, and I, I did it. I completed the level without taking any damage. So I'm kind of disappointed myself that I've already taken damage. Okay. Oh. Nice. The music's fantastic. Hello. What about the dragon? Is that considered an animal? <laughs> oh, I wish I could do a poll. What do we think, chat? Is a dragon an animal? Shooting its butthole. Bullets don't reach. Checkpoint. Sure it is, Looper says. Yeah. Wow, there's a dragon up there. Why is it there? And why is it holding a platform over a broken bridge? So many questions, so little time. Ooh. Nom, nom, nom. I love that 
in like Golden Axe and that when you used to eat like entire chickens in two bites. What monsters. Oh, you can't stick your head through it. Hello. Hello, Joe. If I really wanted open chests, I would hit them with my melee weapon, but I don't have any aspirations in life, so I won't. I love the, the humour in this game. Oh, you can just hold it down. Uh. Feels awesome. Even though I'm absolutely terrible at my aiming when I keep my arms straight. Yeah, that is true. They are giant. They're just giant fire-breathing chickens with scales. Yeah. What is this? Hello. There's a rhyme I always keep in my mind. Use your brain to solve puzzles. You might get a reward. Wait. To be a rhyme, it has to rhyme. Yeah. Oh, you like shooting with your palm facing upwards like that, Spider-Man style. Yeah, that is pretty cool. I know the way that Anna does it in Dot. It's like, look at that, that cannon. There we go, I'll do some Spider-Man. I'll, I'll do it like that. Although it's quite hard to aim, because you've got to make sure. <laughs> Just got to keep it straight. That thing is freaky. It's like a clown or something. Whoa! Sweet cake. Now, what was in that chest? Where was it? It was over here. No, it's gone. Whatever it was. It feels so good. Diagonal is how you can escape. So just for a little production check, chat, how is uh, the live stream, the frame rate and sound levels of me in the game? Is it is it all balanced okay? Um, someone in the chat just asked how we feel about. Oh, there we go. All the everyone, everyone says looks good, sounds good. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Um, so someone was asking how we feel about eye tracking in games because some games they look, they, 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 you can aim where you're looking. I think having it as an assist can be good because it shows intention. But or should it always be about where you're? You know, pointing. I mean, just to let you know, there's no um, eye tracking in this game, I don't believe. Or at least not with uh, shooting or anything. Look at me when you shoot at me. I've not, I've not played Resident Infinite on PSVR 2, but that is a game that I will be live streaming at some point, and I will definitely be using the eye tracking for that. Um, I'll tell you a game that uses eye tracking really well. It's uh, Synapse, which is coming out. Uh, I can't remember when they said it is. I think start start of July. I think it is on the store. Um, but uh, yeah, the early build that we played, the fact that whatever you look at, that's what you're going to use your telekinesis on. Super cool. <laughs> yeah, no one likes to spend most of their time in VR missing shots. Um, also, it's just a cool 
for power fantasies. You know, you feel like an absolute boss if you look at stuff. You know. I think Horizon Call of the Mountain used it to like a bit new way you you were aiming for. Right, those are strong boxes. Right, let's have a look. We can go around here. Hello, mate. Evan, we're peaceful folk around here. So just shoot that dragon up there. Woo. Frogger. Oh, it licked me. Ribbit. Gonna jump back. So, I'm guessing you need an ability to get through this. I think there was something I missed over there, though. Because that goes back to the start. So, let me just have a quick look around here. VR Skater. Yep, out next week or in the week. Um, I'm going to be live streaming that hopefully next weekend. So how's everyone feeling about Pixar at 1978? Every time you... Oh, okay, there's a collectible there. Cartridges. Melees. Ah, oh, so you collect the different melees. What do I think of this game? I um, I mean, I've always had a real soft spot for Pixel Rip games. Um, for me, they're not like... They're not games that you're going to, you know, play again and again. But for me, that's not... All, that's only one type of great game. Other games, they're just like singular experiences where they make you feel a certain thing. And these games are celebrations. They're love letters to the past with retro gaming. And I think uh, they achieve them so well. As for this game in particular, too early to say, but so far it feels great. It, sometimes it's a bit weird when you've got to like picking up the chicken and you know doing certain things. Like when I had to hand over that note and I was trying to let go of the control. It wasn't very responsive with how to like let go of it, um, so there's a few things that feel a bit rough around the edges. We're peaceful folk around here, so just shoot that. Okay, yeah. well, I've done it. Okay. somewhere you can go in there. So all this stuff must unlock later. So I assume we'll be back here. Player sync. Oh. Hey, I'm back here. Right, here we are. Back in it. Oh, there's a big... These rocks you can't destroy yet, but maybe you've got to do it. There you go, this is the bridge. Now, I think in the first two Pixel Rip games, when you died, you lost all your um, pixels. Okay, so we got like a crocodile. Oh, no, I timed it wrong. Dope. Okay, there we go. It's just you 
yawning, isn't it? Just a yawning alligator or crocodile. <laughs> Someone is washing dishes while checking out this show. They said this game is this game music is fun to wash dishes to. Does it make you feel like every time you wash a dish, you get a uh, you get a bit of XP? That'd make that's. I remember that scared. Hi friend. That scared Did you me like the, first the donuts time from that earlier? Happened. So weird. I only have prune flavored ones left, and I think we know why. How Anyways, do I drop it? I was hoping you could help me okay. with something. You just this cartridge right here has bugs in it, but I'm sure you're the right person to debug it. Could you get rid of them? Don't worry, I got a new prototype for you as a prize. All right. If you say so. Nice! I'll be back in a sec. Okay. Centipede. <laughs> you feel like you worked with someone like that before. Oh, it's a bit glitchy. Step on the buttons to stun it. When stunned, slap the screen and kill them with your hands or with paper balls. Oh, I've got to go to the top first. Oh. I got caught. Okay, that's that's easier now. So that's cool. Okay. Wait. Said with paper balls. Could I use dice? Or there you go. Strategic death. Yes. So okay, you don't have to click the grip button. You um, just have to move your hand away from the controller to let go. No! I hate you. Nice ice creams in the corner. Easier if I release all the bugs first. Oh, I see. You can just keep doing that. Got you. Yeah. Good. Cool. They don't go. I didn't know if they went back into the machine after a while. This is awesome, mate. <laughs> it's such a cool way of just remixing classic games and. going on in this office. Ah, oh, right. I got it this time. This is actually a bit more challenging. It's because the rest of the game so far has been pretty easy. So I've kind of... Time. Oh, the ice cream is giving you health. Okay. There you are! A new prototype just Sec for you. Can hear my I don't think it's going to hit the yeah, market, concentration. but at go. least it'll help you with your main character and whatnot. Let me know what you think. See ya! <laughs> Someone in the chat said, uh, as a, uh, a real game developer, 
this is what the debugging process is really like. Um, okay, so we've got a shoot button now, so I guess we're going back in here, and the shoot button might let me shoot that big stone. There we go. Which makes me want to go back to the start, because wasn't there... Yeah, it was this stuff. Yeah, oh, okay, this was it. This is what I was thinking about. What? Oh, okay, what if we make a game about being a game developer? Who would play that? Being a dev is boring. Oh, there is a ladder up there. Do you know one of my first games I ever played? It was on the Master System. It was built in. It was called Alex. Alex the Kid. Ooh. You just got to absolutely. Didn't even count how many times you got to hit it. Hey, Barbara. It's me, your friend Nathy. So. I was watching this, well, super strange movie about a guy that enters computers through some weird glasses helmet thingy. I mean, as if, right? <laughs> Got it? Ugh, never mind. Nothing excites you, man, so I'll talk to you later. Bye! That's Nathy. You have to, um, you, know, you have to tap it to shoot. So, um,. I'm actually one of the phone calls in this game, and I was so overworked when I recorded it. It's so cringe, it's terrible. <laughs> Although it might just be me, because I've never done it before, and I'm just like, Bugster, yeah. Bugster, throw that back. Oh, you can stand on their head for the first bit. Hey, can I have my ball back, bug? Quarter back, bug. Lucky. Nice. Is that one of the things you've got to collect? Oh, it won't just stay on it. I think it is, though. So, actually, that was... Hello, it's GT from Gamertag VR Magazine. Gamertag. Listen, we've had lots of parents complaining about that goblin poster. I mean, these kids are actually crying. Is that really your new hero? Tag, Nathy, the whole crew. It's so awesome. <laughs> Everyone in the chat is saying, oh, it's the people on the phone. It's awesome. Yeah, all the uh, without pro folk are on it, except for Wes, which is a shame. Right, I don't know now what I'm meant to do here. How am I meant to get to that side? Any My ideas? We'll go, we'll go over here. She might crack so under the creepy, pressure. man. Ah, it's fine. She's been helping me out since college. <laughs> Wes wanted free paper, word. Well, you got to go bold. Okay, this looks right. Oh, don't don't hit me with an egg. 
There we go. Ta-da! Ah, oh, so you could have done it in any order. Gotcha. Let's go this way first. Okay, let's go up here. Okay, there's another book. Okay. Did you get one of Michelle's donuts? Um, I didn't, but the intern took a prune one. Yeah, he's been in the bathroom for at least two hours. Oh, wow. That's pretty bad. Don't drop an egg on me. Got it absolutely hammering it. No. I missed a pixel. That's why I want to go back. Wait. Just getting paid for two hours. Yeah. Oh, what we got here? You're live on Yub 1706 FM. Don't say hello. Say hello, Mr. Treeman, to win a pair of tickets for a concert. Hello? Hello. No! Oh, I didn't want to miss it again. Whoa! Right, there's a key there. I'm guessing that's good. Now, is the key find the time breach? Or do I just go back to where we were before? Here. Let's do it. How are we doing for time? We're doing good. We're doing good. Oh. There's the key. My keys. Of course. I must have lost them somewhere. Let me give you something back. I know a way you can use the gems you collect. Oh, they're called pixels? Well, don't you use your pixels to make things prettier? Touch the power and you'll see what I mean. You can use the art ability to add pixels to things that are plain uh, to make them more complex. Use L2 to shoot and add pixels to the surroundings. It's the pixelator. Now you can enter my house to get my bag. I never said I wasn't a lazy bear. Okay, that is really cool. So... Oh, there we go. Ah, oh, that's cool. Why is it? Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Let's get the bag. Nice. <laughs> that's funny. I like that. I like that a lot. Take your bag. Thank you so much, Dot. My quest for gems will be much easier now. A time breach. I do think there's something like that in the castle. It helped me so much. I'm guessing it's that. Look at that. That's awesome. See? I'm not lazy after all. Well, can I go back through this way? Because if so, there was all these things to be. I've got 423. Why is it? Oh, it is. Okay, it was doing it. It just it didn't look it. Yeah, sorry, Dot. You. <laughs> sorry, Dot. Your pool is in another castle. Yeah. Uh, okay, so we got some stuff there. Nice. Right. Wasn't there one like round there? Oh wow. Oh. I don't know what I'm shooting. 
shooting him. I don't want to waste any. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. So, I'm always wondering whether I should keep talking to commentators. Sometimes I'm like, I just, I'm happy to play and let you just take in the music and the sound effects because it's super cute and super awesome. Shoot. Okay, so it won't let you shoot unless it's needed, so you're not going to waste any. That's good to know. Hey! Spider-Man. It's technique you were mentioning. That's it. Take that. And that. Now I'm that stuff. I mean... There we go. Woo. Hey, how did you get in here? I guess this is where we part ways, but I had a great time on this quest of ours. Guess I'll see if I can find more castles to explore. I kind of took a liking to them. Bye, Bentley. Fantastic, Dot. This phone sounds way better. Now, this green portal is the time breach I mentioned. My readings indicate it will instantly take you to wherever and whenever Cyberlord is. It's pretty complicated physics, and there's no time to explain. You have to go to the past. Run to 1972, you go. Help bug and stop Cyberlord Lord in his tracks. Right, before we do... Oh, that's cool. Oh, I was about to say before I go in it. But here we go! 1972. Okay, it's not letting me put them where I want. No? That's weird. Cool, cool room. Okay, I don't know what's going on there. Video pinball. Oh, there we go. Okay, it's, that's how you do it. Oh, this is awesome. 
No, 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 no. <sighs> wow, baby bug. No. How could a tiny little sister like you make such a huge mess? Listen, I I'm going out with my bike, so make sure you clean up before I come back, or, or else. <sighs> get out the way. Dad will mind anyways, cause his favorite can do anything. You get out the way, <sighs> dude. Is he sick? <sighs> always, always that last one, right? Or last two, but ah. Uh. Come on. <laughs> Three hours later. That's it. Nice, I've been lured. Okay. Well, of course you're here, Doc. And at the right moment, too. As you can now behold, the masterpiece I created in the kid's past. Let's get on with this fight, and I'll knock you your chalks off. Oh, here we go. Oh, I just came out of my head then. Look. Ah! Right. Let's go. Oh, no. I don't know why it disconnected then. So I already... I, I, I gave Cybin Lord a free hit. Because I'm that kind of hero. Giving the uh, arch enemy... My arch nemesis. A chance. Although, Cybin Lord doesn't seem to really need to do much. Just needs to potter about. That's it. Get it Get it round the back. That's it. There you go. Yeah! Reminds me of Sonic Spinball. I love that game. Okay. Maybe I've got to hit him two more times. Whoa. That's cool. Oh, this is awesome. Oh, this is what I love about this game. These moments are really cool. Okay, do I just... Yeah. And the music. Oh, this is awesome. Take that, Cybin Lord. You've got three more lives. Well, we'll just do that. And... One more there. Oh. It is really cool, isn't it? That's it. Oh, so he's got one and a half left. And he's got just less than one. Here we go. Throw a paper ball or use... one hand on it. <laughs> there we go. Surely blocks are more damaging. You're going to get it on your day off tomorrow. Awesome. I mean, this is... I mean, the mu it's the music, it's everything. Good bit, of, good bit of fun. Nostalgic fun. I mean, I love Pixel Rips music. Whoever composed it um, really captures the feeling. And we're going to be with more, having more nostalgia after this live stream because we're moving on next to Transformers Beyond Reality. 
the PSVR 2 version, which I played the PS VR version of, and um, Oh, he's going to be in the air, is he? Whoa! Talk about multitasking, right? <laughs> Go on! Ah, our battle might be over, but this war wasn't drawn to a close. I'll continue with my plan, and I'll soon be the hero everyone loves. Our next fight won't be for the pain to part. I assure you. Why, Cyber Lord? Heart crystal recovered. <laughs> Masterpiece. Art mission complete. There we go. Hey! You didn't fix the mess! It kind of looks worse. Just because Dad says you're the artist of the family doesn't mean you can just oh, balance do that. One on there. Ugh. Let's get another piece right. up there. I'll help you out. Just this once. But but you gotta tell Dad I was nice. Alright. Uh tell me what now? What up? Well, I'm back, kids. Oh, well, look at all this paper. Were you creating new art for your dad's office, Ladybug? No. Oh, looks like you take after my creativity, huh? Dot. Wonderful news about securing the art crystal. We are now one step closer to restoring far of a land to its former glory. Legend says that the combination of the inspiration crystals make the essence of our world. You see, our land was made when Bug felt inspired. These were the pivotal moments of our making, our grandiose, precious past. Oh, to be a part of history being shaped before your eyes. How I wish to be there. But it wasn't meant to be. 1996 still needs someone here. Anyways, let's move on to the next inspirational crystal. See if you can find any path to the next time breach with Bug's help. Missile, he knows some commands. <laughs> missile command. Sit, missile. It's funny. Oh, chicken. I won't be taking questions from the press, thank you. The chicken has been great. Yesterday she fought six thieves. That is pretty impressive. Right, player sync. So I guess we're just going to do this, maybe. pixel so it is like slowly turning just having a look here cool I think we I think uh, I think I think we'll play a bit more I mean if people don't want any more spoil they can obviously stop watching the stream um, but let's let's keep going I, I oh pizza mm. and it's unlimited pizza super good 
Alright. Nice. Let's do this. Have a look at the store. Sounds like there's a party nearby. The artwork on the wall and everything is super cool. Sounds like a party, doesn't it? Only. Wait, do you have to um, avoid it? Okay, maybe. All right. So we, we got to we got to go to this one here. Here we go. Grooving Freddy. I love that you play it as dot in all of them. Hey, Bugster! No, not so, now. I heard through the grapevine that you're getting started on the audio soon. <laughs> heard? And audio? Get it? Uh, you got it. Uh, anyway, uh, that's gonna happen Why don't you right something else? now, right? Great. Hey, good talk. Keep working on that audio stuff, like our good old college days. You Can't you wait to hear own. it. <laughs> I'm gonna eat ya. Who could it be? Hi, Barbara. It is Shure Yoshida here. Just calling to remind you that we need a meeting to decide the topics to be discussed at our touch point about what we need to send to the client's brainstorm. Shuei! It was Shuei! Shuei Yoshida. Amazing. Legend. Absolute legend. Awesome to be in a game with him. Can I go down there? No. Okay, have I got to do all that again now? Hey, Michelle. Coming to the party later? You bet I am. And I'm Dragon Bug with me. Me <laughs> Oh, Dragon. That's a little intense. <laughs> well, do you see how intense she can be with work? But don't worry. Bug is pretty fun once you get her away from... Uh, well, I'm just here. Any electronic device. Uh-oh. Why'd you do that? I guess I'm going to be going into the game. Someone messed it up. And you can go back to the old games. I could see him there. Okay, this is cool. Hello, traveller. I'm Freddy, daredevil by day, musician by night. Yes, my wings do take me around the world so I can play concerts wherever I go. However, I can't do that without my guitar, which was stolen by some squares who can't appreciate my talent. Return it to me and I'll give you a prize. I think it's inside the disco club. guns and they're not using them. I feel like I need a 
really need a powerful weapon. I mean, can I do it with this? Yeah. Putting the club up in the air is going to stop me from getting in. Yeah, okay, should probably let me finish. You wish there was a ladder you can use? What about that? Okay. Oh. Wow. There we go. Nice. Need to get over there somehow. Wrong ability, so I need another ability. Okay. Hmm. Okay, we'll go back this way. Again, music, super cool, super cool. This looks dead dangerous. It's all right. I guess we go down here. That's so cool. Uh, excuse me. How do we get in? Uh, yeah, blah, blah, blah. So... Do here. Okay, I'm a bit lost. Because they won't let me in here. So, we're going to go back the way that um, I came, which was, well, I could go this way first. But. Oh, it looks like there's something you can shoot that side on top of it. So I do have to go back. Diagonal, diagonal. Yeah. Okay. But is that going to unlock anything? Maybe not yet. Just says wrong ability. So, I mean, I built the ladder for him. There's a ladder there. I'm wondering if I've glitched it by building the ladder first. Do you know what I mean? But then that would seem like a weird thing to do. I think I've been lost this soon into the game. Okay. Shoot the weird diagonal floating platforms you say, like these ones. Or them. So I've unlocked this so it allows me to go back here. I mean, mate, I haven't un maybe back, maybe back on the, the flat screen game it's done something. Yeah, because the ladder was broken, wasn't it? So um, now the ladder should be fixed. There you go. Party just started. Like, where's your mask? Party just started. Like, where's your mask? Oh. This might be hungry. I've already had a massive pizza. 
Oh, well, wait, party me... pooper. Why well, let me grab it? Trophy on the old Great game, which was you had to complete it without taking any damage. I could be mistaken. Hey, Bug, it's Julien the Frenchie. Have you seen the news? Your colleague, you know, the one who created Adventure, he added his name inside the game. I think you should do it too, but instead of your name, just add a hidden bug. <laughs> okay. bug. Just for that. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I'd love to know if Anna's completed the no death trophy. Okay. That's good. Here we go. Hi! How's my favorite friend doing? And no, I'm not saying that just because I have another favor to ask. But if you could remove some bugs for me again, I might throw in a new feature for you. How does that sound? Let's do it. Food fight. Yeah. I'll be right back for my game buggy. Here we go. Is it going to be the same mechanics again? We'll find out. Survive the party. <laughs> Barbara Rivers. Okay. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna... Never use it as a weapon.
Phaser is a good weapon, but... Yeah, extra protein. Oh, no. I've got to start again from the beginning. Oh. Right. I got a bit too greedy. That was the problem. Very buggy. There we go. Oh, there's a big bug there. There we go. Pizza. There we go. Thank you so much. Bug right. the bug killer. Put this to good use. Just payback. Can I not give the thumbs up? Okay. Oh. What do I do with this? Where does where's the disc go? Party just started. Like, where's your mask? Yeah. <laughs> Almost scared me there. Right, where do I put this in? I thought I put it in there. Or... We need something with Battlezone's graphics and gameplay. You know? I know. How about a spin-off called Peace Zone? Right, floppy disk dance <sighs> with sweet summer child Frank. Get to the Oh, cheers. It's locked. Hey, how are you feeling? You got John Rings here. <laughs> can, I, can I borrow your amazing so tech it, you said at the side of the screen. But. Oh, is it just that? There we go. Sorry, that's what you meant. I thought you meant the side of the monitor. <laughs> To the disco club. Hey, friend, take a breather from work. Have a sip of beer. I can dance. Beer drunk the bug. I mean, what year was I born? I was in '87. I did. We had um, ours was always below the um, screen. We had discs like that, but they were um, they weren't in the screen. They were just like below it there. I knew that was gonna make some people laugh. Okay, who gift wrapped all my supplies? Happy birthday, Frank. Wait, it's not, it's not my birthday. Happy birthday, Frankster. Frank Murder. Congratulations. This is difficult. Ugh. It's Julien de Frenchy. Yeah, some repeating stuff now. Okay. Yes, 
take a hit there. That was a tricky bit. I can't attack at the moment. Shoot. Why is it not shooting? Oh, do I have to take... Yeah, you got to take it. Take it out. I didn't think Thank his you. brief riding thing was this. Yeah, you got to take the disc out. So, gotcha. Throw it to me, bug. Yeah, we got it. Dude, what an arm! Oh. Okay. Nice purse you got there, Frank. It's not a purse. It's my man pack. Here we go. This guy. Now, put that back in. Dancers only. That's fine. I'm a dancer. Hey, back. Stay from upstairs. Not sure if you remember me, but we met during the hot tub party. Um, unless I'm wrong and you weren't there. <laughs> um. I'm busy. I'm dancing here. While you're uh, workout tapes, I'm a think about bulking up. <laughs> ah. This game doesn't look that fun. More frustrating. But that was that was old school games, man. Okay, so you can dance while jumping. That's good. Buggy, I need your autograph on this contract. Please, just touch the paper? How is that? Thanks, Miss Businesswoman. Don't egg on me. I'm on the edge of my seat, literally, now. Oh. Right, I'm learning now. I can just keep the dance button pressed while jumping. That makes it a little bit easier. Are we sure having one person responsible for all aspects of one game is the right thing to do? This is really tricky. Still burger there? Okay. Oh, wow. Now, not now, not now, now. <laughs> Sorry, I really concentrated, was I? Hey, it's Brian Paul from Without Pro Magazine. L listen, Brian! I've been waiting for that press release for way too long. So just tell me, when is Rip Pixel coming out? Uh, soon. Cheers, Brian. See, Brian did it good. You know what? We will end the stream when I when I get my voice thing. Although we might not actually have enough time. What are we doing? What are we doing? Time. Okay, because I need to get some food and take a break uh, for 25 minutes. Uh, so let's let's see how we get on here. Oh, 
I am in this. I've been told in level three. I have been shown the video of my appearance. Right. Okay, hold. So, switch between powers. Doesn't actually switch with powers like it says. Hmm. That's too far. Let's uh, run back background here. There we go. So I thought the light would change. Like it'd flick between them. Music's so good. Alive. I just came to dance. Right, let's hit these out of the sky. Let's swat them. Okay, what happened there? Don't know. Does that mean my health is low? I don't know. Ooh. Oh, does that mean it's a uh, spawn? Wrong ability. I'm trying to change it. What? Right, let's do that first. Oh, okay. You change the ability on this hand. That sounds weird. Okay, so it does do that, but you got to do it with this. That just feels a bit weird that you would have to press the button on the other hand to do it. That's kind of cool. Right. Let's go back over here. Yeah, it just means I'm injured. I still can't go in there yet. So we're going to go around here. Six, six, six. Ah! Yeah, that's the first time I've seen her. Turret be helpful as well. It was a very helpful turret. There we go. Can I hit the uh, things back? Yeah. Oh, you can. Home run. That's amazing. Got a trophy. Home run. That was awesome. Okay. 
Oh. Tommy wanted to leave. What am I going to name the turret? Yeah, well, we. Good old Bricky from The Last of Us. Um, what we got? Terry? Terry the turret? Is that a good name? Terry does sound terrific, like atari a I thought the uh, name for this uh, video was quite good. atari a terrific Terry Turret. atari terri atari a atari Terry Turret. There we go. This part of the game, like, it's kind of interesting, but because it's very similar to the first area, um, it, it feels a bit repetitive, but, um, I mean, yeah, it's interesting to see. I mean, there are more mechanics you get, which are cool. Should be letting me do more. Wow, that was a lot of uh, pixels. This is that just meant to be a wall? Because I feel like it's meant to be expanded. But no. See, it's like the little things I picked up upon where I'm not entirely sure what you're supposed to do. Oh, electric guitar. 
but you can't you can't actually choose what you're picking up. It's just random. It'd be cool if you could actually select and say this is the cosmetic I'm using. Unless there is a way, and I've just not noticed it yet. pacing a bit because all I'm thinking about is like I can't wait to get this done so I can get to the other sort of mini games and stuff oh I got I mean it's a star what's that collected 10 out of 40 cartridges right Let's have a look here. I didn't actually know they were cartridges was I slow did anyone else know they were cartridges I thought they were like books or something or tablets um. right is it, are they gonna let me here now Nope. I missed the blue thing, did I? Thank you for pointing it out. There's a bit of delay on the chat, so... Um I'm just like, do I go back into this now? But then, because I have built the bridge, so maybe that is. So look. Right. Oh. <laughs> Let's have a look. Marvin, this is Nolan. The employees are starting a Pong Championship. Find the time breach. So I talked to the team about asteroids. Yeah, I don't think this day. is what I'm supposed to do. Well, no steroids for me. I'm completely natural. I got right. my muscles from a grandma. All right, well, in that case, everyone, uh, this was Pixel Ripped 1978. Um, yeah, I mean, that was a real, really good fun. I really, really enjoyed it. The heat in this room is uh, makes it quite difficult, and I'm, I'm really looking forward to standing up. So um, we're going to end it there. Uh, Pixel Ripped 1978 is out now uh, on the PlayStation Store. Um, all... Uh, the information about this game, about the developers, Arvo, um, the launch trailer. Um, if you want to see the review, uh, Brian Paul on PSVR about Pro has done one. All of that is linked in the description of this video. But I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone for tuning into this Let's Play. It's been a really good time. Um, it's amazing to play a new Pixel Rip title on PSVR 2. And I do look forward to jumping back into this uh, and, and seeing it through until the end. So do let me know in the comment section below what you thought about this game. Is this a game that you have played before? Have you played the previous two titles? Or is this brand new? Uh, and does this appeal? I really do think it comes a lot down to uh, your relationship with gaming. If you're someone who grew up in the 70s, 80s or 90s, this will you know, impact the way that you uh, see retro gaming and how you feel about it when you see the music and all the, 
the pixel art but um i think it's absolutely wonderful and i want to say a huge huge um congrats to my friend anna ribeiro and the entire arval team for making this come to fruition um we didn't get to see me in the game yet i believe it's on level three uh, but i need to quickly uh get a drink uh maybe eat a few snacks i've got some chocolate muffins in the kitchen uh, i've got a banana as well um maybe make myself a cup of tea and then i will get ready for the next let's play which will be terminator no it won't be it'll be transformers beyond reality uh, because Transformers, uh, the new movie has just come out. So I thought, what better time to uh, play a Transformers game? So I am planning on doing a Let's Play for every PSVR 2 title that exists. So if you want to be a part of the journey, subscribe today. Ring the bell on youtube.com forward slash miles. Follow me across social media. All the links are in the description. And I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>